again. I am here with the lovely bear Hi. for a change. Um, and today we are having a bit of an adventure. Today we've decided that we wanted to go for lunch, but um, we wanted to possibly have a few drinkies at lunch. So we thought, well, we can't obviously drive. We're no drinking and driving, kids. So what are we going to do? It's a bit too far for a taxi. So we've decided to, to take, take the bus. bus. Now this is quite special because neither of us can actually remember the last time we went on a bus and I'm pretty sure that most of you probably do go on buses a lot of the time. Uh, excuse me, I went on a bus last weekend. Did you? I did, in Northampton. Oh, I think mine, my, the last time I went on a bus was probably about seven years ago when I used <laughs> to have um, a weekend job and before I got my car. So yeah, about seven years ago was the last time I went on a bus. don't even know how much the bus costs anymore. Um, so this is going to be a real adventure. So we're going to go on the bus and we're going to have some lunch and then we thought later on we would go bowling <laughs> because um, people don't go bowling enough anymore I don't think. So um, yes and it's a beautiful sunny day. Look the sun is shining and we are very happy even though we're both quite snivelly. Um, it's going to be a good day so we are going to take you along for the ride. Woo! Come on. Do you even Why know which bus? Why giving me ten pounds? Well, how much did you ask for? Twenty. I don't know. Yeah. And look, did I pass ten or did I pass twenty? I don't know. Oh, I don't swear on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> did you get a receipt? No. Oh, I think that was our bus. I think we just oh, missed no, the bus. Not, I don't know what I'm doing. Which bus are we getting on? What do you do? Do you ask him? Can you just please take did me I to? 10 or did I, pass 20? I don't know whether you pressed ten or twenty. Oh. This is really stressful. We should have just driven. Okay, so we're in the queue for the bus. What do we do? Do we just ask? Uh, yeah, you just take me to have a return ticket, please. Can you take me to the city, please, <laughs> Mr. Bus Driver? I'm a bit scared. Kids up. <laughs> you might get angry. You might get angry. You're like somebody's already breasted. <gasps> interesting our little ride on the bus I quite like the bus yeah like the, bus. the bus is fun the bus is fun that's a posh bus over there it's <laughs> a real posh bus with like leather seats and everything but we couldn't get on the posh bus because that wasn't our bus that was an interesting conversation right so people are looking at me like I'm a weirdo so I'm just gonna make this really really quick um so we're gonna go for lunch now because we're both really hungry as usual um and we're gonna go for Japanese it's gonna be quite fun um so we're gonna take you along with us and you can see our wonderful lunch yes more people staring at me like I'm crazy <laughs> hello Beth are you excited for your I'm tapenaki show so excited look we have like front row seats and we're pretty much the only people in here this is very exciting so we have our beer it's Kirin Ichiban sorry if I pronounced that horribly wrong um, and then we're gonna have a show and I think things are gonna be on fire and we get things thrown at us um, so that's just what you want on a Saturday night show. <laughs> I'm very excited. You excited? I'm really excited. Exciting. Cheers. Cheers, darling. Clink. Is it gonna burn your mouth? We're okay. <laughs> We're okay. <laughs> Me so soup. Me so soup. It's so good. My goodness, here's our chef coming with all the food. I'm excited. Woo! Oh bloody hell that popped! <laughs> I think I've lost my eyebrows. <laughs> Game time, Kevin. 
And so death. it's game time. <laughs> Japanese restaurant with Kevin the chef who is adorable Kevin. give him a round of applause like this video if you loved Kevin the chef because he was absolutely <laughs> adorable so um, we are just gonna go and do a bit of shopping now I think we've got some makeup to purchase yes. Um, so favourite shopping. Yeah, we're on the hunt for mascaras and blushers and concealers. And a, and a powder highlighter. And a powder highlighter. Oh, yeah. I've got a good one that I could recommend. Um, so, yeah, so we're going to do some shopping. Um, and then we thought we might go for a few cocktails or something. Um, and then possibly our friends might be meeting us to come and bowl. Um, but, yeah, we're having a lovely day so far. So, um, yes, come along and join us for the rest of the day. Beth is angry at me because we were halfway out the shop and I spotted this dress and I had to buy it and now we're I'd in like to show you another... why I'm angry with her. Look at the queue. Look how long that queue is. And we've just been in a queue upstairs. Ah but they go down really quick and it's really don't. nice and it's only ten pounds. You can't, you can't just chase after a man and tell him that he's got a sticker on his leg. He's fine with the sticker on his leg, he loves it. There's a moustache. <gasps> Sorry. Moustache. We are off for cocktails now. We've finished shopping and we are tired and my feet hurt. Um, so it's cocktail o'clock. So Beth, what's your cocktail? It is a mandarin ma martini. Mandarin martini, what's in mandarin that? Mandarin martini. It has, <laughs> I have to look at the book. It has, triple sec, um, a light tube liqueur that I can't pronounce. 
um, and orange juice, mm -hmm. and it's actually amazing. That's good. What have I got? You've got a Malaysian mojito. A Malaysian mojito. Which is a mojito, but instead of using Bacardi rum, it's using the, the lychee liqueur. We're having a very um, Asian theme today, aren't oh. we, with our Japanese lunch and our Asian persuasion cocktails. I'm not convinced about that name. No, me either. Um, a little strange. Okay, so um, we've finished our shopping. We are all tired out. I've even had to change my shoes. <laughs> Because my feet were hurting so much in our high heel shoes. So um, well, let's do a little mini haul. What have you brought today, Beth? Okay, today I have bought a new lipstick, mm. which is from Maybelline, and it's called Hollywood Red, and I'm wearing it. Lovely. <laughs> it's very nice. I've also bought some more of my favourite mascara in the whole wide world, the They're Real, yeah. by Benefit, which is the best mascara. I bought a new handbag from Primark. It's just huge. Mm. I'm yeah, living the big jacket. butch bags at the moment. It's a lovely blue Ooh. colour. I bought some more tights, some face wipes, so boring stuff. And I bought a hair turban. A hair turban? A hair turban. It's got a very um, lovely. And it's got a very blingy little, little bit on the side. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> But mainly because when I wash my hair, I leave the towel on it for ages and I have such a gigantic towel that it kind of like falls off on the side like this and I can't do anything while I'm waiting for my hair to dry. So hopefully this will solve that problem. Lovely. Your shoes. They were from Primark and they were £8 because I couldn't wear my big boots anymore. And these ones from Barrett's, we do like them. Um, I also bought Benefit there real because I've never tried it. I'd give it a go. And our baby is so lovely, she always convinces me to buy sticks so bad. I also bought the new Elnet um, heat styling spray in the volume. The volume one. I really like the box. Um, and that's it all that I bought. This dress that I showed you in front. This is the dress that I was angry about. And it's so pretty though. And, and some tights. And that's it really. So not a lot today. Oh, it's a penguin and he's so cute. <laughs> he makes me happy every time I look at my phone. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Penguin. Shows Hello. I made a phone face. And his name is Sausage. And he is an owl. <laughs> he's really cute. He's a phone cozy. And Sausage. Aww, he's so cute. We decided to have pudding in our cocktail bar as well because we didn't have any pudding at lunch time. I've nearly finished mine. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Let's had a pecan tart and I've had apple crumble and custard. Yum. And now we have strawberry bellini. So we now want to um, go bowling um, but we're trying to find the bus to get us to bowling. We have to catch another bus and it's a lot more stressful this time because we don't know where we're going from and we don't know what bus we have to get. We have we've to find an elusive bus station. So we've looked on the internet and we found the number of bus that we need to get but we can't find the actual bus station for to get the bus. This is so stressful. No wonder people drive everywhere. I, d I don't like it. <laughs> and I want to go home And now. it's getting dark as well. Oh, it's a nightmare. So we found the bus station and it's like a bloody airport. I, d I had no idea. Oh, the fancy. I had no idea. Um, so it's a bit strange. So we sat waiting for our departure. At, um, in the departure lounge. In the departure lounge. Waiting for our departure at uh, quarter past six. Just reading a magazine before our flight. Uh, a bus. <laughs> So we're going to go bowling, um, but all the lanes were booked until 9 o'clock and we couldn't be bothered to wait for 3 hours. So we're now playing bingo. Um, I don't quite know what's happened. We're about to play the exit. We're starting. <gasps> how people get addicted to gambling. I know, this is very We just played Good like, oh, well, don't gentlemen. give you any breaks here, bloody yeah. hell. Thank you. Right, to so the main event. One room pounds the winner, and well done to you. Phase three close. On to page number four we go. Oh, this yeah. one is a three four four page. Come on, Come on page four. Looking for any one line. Blue 60. It's Anton Dan. Blue 46. 
It's red 10. White 80. It's not. Yellow 57. Yellow 38. Red 1. Yellow 32. This is the face Yellow 31. When other people win. Red 80. Red 60. A white line game. So the big piece play a white line game. <laughs> it's bingo and we didn't win. Did oh you no, know? we didn't win anything. We were really sad. We were like really close on some of the games and we got so excited. Um, but no, we didn't win. But it was jolly good fun actually. So <laughs> I genuinely do think I will be back. Yes, I'm probably going to have a bingo problem. Yes, we now have gambling <laughs> problems. I think we've got an issue. But yes, jolly good fun if you fancy a, a, an exciting, tense night out. Um, get yourself down to Gala Bingo. <laughs> And there's music on it, and leather seats, and free Wi-Fi. Best bus ever. What's going on? <laughs> I'm so I may never get off. <laughs> I could just stay here forever. <laughs> I'm never driving again. <laughs> it's amazing. Gonna be this way.